overdose vapes Keep your wicks wet And your coils tight If you're looking for new flavors And all about the clouds We're all filling up a clear road We're dripping on the sub On reviews for the juice While Trav and Josh host View it only two And prepare for overdose Hello and welcome back to Overdose Vapes. O D V in the house. Get used to it. Yeah. We're not going nowhere. Get real. Get fucking real, people. So, we back with you with another routine e liquid. You know, anything but routine. Yeah. E liquid. That first one. Ooh, feeling frappe. Feeling frappy. Was fucking it was a, epic. It was a strawberry milkshake um, done better than any other. It was epic. Yeah. It was fucking great. And we love strawberry cream vapes, so it we was do. like it was like a, a harmony. You yeah. know what I mean? If you haven't seen that, uh, check that video yep. directly after this one or before, however you want to do it. Check the video, baby. Check that video. Feeling frappy. What's and today, Trav? Today we are looking at Danish Dreams. Ooh, it's a Danish, bruh. So if you didn't know this routine liquid, I think it's part of your morning routine. It's, yeah. you know, coffee shop. Coffee shop vibe. Yes, yeah, so the Starbucks first one vibe. was a strawberry frappy. Um, there's a mocha one, and then this one is Danish Dreams. And uh, read that one. This one, okay, so Danish Dreams is a golden, dreamy Danish filled with creamy butterscotch bliss. Boom! Butterscotch Danish? And they have the little cup system yeah. here of rating the flavors, like how much is, how much of each flavor is in it. Yep. They have uh, five cups of Danish, four cups of butterscotch, three cups of custard, and five cups of divine. Ooh! I'm glad they put five cups. Let's check out these amazing bottles. Great bottles, um, great packaging. Yeah, they're not gonna let a lot of sunlight through, and but you can see the liquid. I like that. You can see your uh, levels. And these little boxes, they they're like recycled cardboard. I mean, you, you can't like tell that from the video, I'm sure, but they're really nice. Great stuff, and they all say blended for chuffing by your trusted barista. A barista. Awesome, right? Yeah. Fuck a barista. It's about a barista. They barista. You know, they definitely got the nice coffee shop vibe. It's Wake crazy. up and taste the routine. Um, 80-20, and they sent these out in 1.5 milligrams. And you can get them only in 0, 1.5, 3, and 6. Yep. Boom. We're here because th these kind of packages, you're not going to be able to rip them open in the store. So we're letting you know exactly what they taste like and what to expect. And see the bottles and how they smell. And out of the yeah. bottle, this shit smells bomb. Ugh. It smells really thick with that, that kind of pastry essence. You know, that's the mocha. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you're like, damn, that smells that like mocha. smells good, too. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you get that butterscotch and that... that the meatiness of that Danish. Mm -hmm. All right, let's try it. It's got a ton of texture. I mean, you get that Danish. So, you know, it's such a strong part of the flavor, as it should be. I mean, it's a Danish flavor. Um, oh. With that backup of the, of the butterscotch, it's fucking excellent. There's a, there's a touch of custard in there. Uh, what do we got? Three cups of custard. Yeah, um, I see, I don't get a lot of custard. Um, I do get this creaminess that kind of goes with the butterscotch. The butterscotch mm. is a little creamed out. Um, maybe that's where the custard's at for me. Um, but for me, it's mostly like Danish up front with a nice backing of that, of that creamy butterscotch. I mean, I get a slight tad of coffee. I mean, just a, just a minute little detail of coffee in there. Whoa, this vape is good. It's cloudy as fuck. So cloudy. 80-20. I mean, uh, you know, this company is the same company as, uh, R&R. And what's the fucking well? It's not the same company, but same the same, same people. Ty Tyra Fam. Yeah. She she mm -hmm. was behind some of our favorite juices of the past, like Smacks and R and R and Striker. She kind of like was like you know deep into like some of those really same people heavyweight yeah. kind of uh, juices. So Holy this is crap. this is something like one of her new lines, um, you know. And she's got a couple more coming out, and we're gonna take a look at those. But Routine is oh. special, man. It's it's got it's a real special kind of line. This has like. The perfect texture in it. I mean, 
It's really, I mean, that's the first thing I get. Like, even more than the flavor is, like, that texture, you know what oh, I mean? It's got man. a real beautiful texture to it. Inhale and exhale is real great. Great lung fill. Real thick, fucking dense clouds because of that 80 oh, It's one of those vapes you just can't get enough in your mouth. Like, you just want more. So good. That lung fill, I mean, these are at one and a half, so, you know, there's there's no... There's no harshness or, you know, real smooth. Real smooth. I think in three, they'd be really nice too, though. I mean, the smoothness is... Yeah, I would, I would you know, I would step it up to three, honestly. Um, yeah. Because uh, I can take a little bit of that, that Nick hit. Yeah, this is great for testing, but, uh, you know, I think a three would be perfect because I like a little bit of that. It almost helps the flavor sometimes. Nicotine definitely helps the flavor. Yeah. I, you Not know, that just this for needs me. help. No. This is great. Um... I think that they nailed exactly what they're going for here. Um, it has a has a little bit of like a lingering aftertaste, um, like a sweet lingering aftertaste. That butterscotch. That butterscotch. The butterscotch is not um, too in your face. You know, first comes that that texture of that like bear claw or whatever that Danish kind of thing, and then that butterscotch is drizzled on afterward, yeah. and it just adds a nice fucking butterscotch sweetness to it. Totally. What a lovely vape. Yeah, it's a real nice vape. Um, I don't know if it would be all day vape for me. It's mm. it's a little sweet for all day vape. It might be like a nice after dinner vape or a nice, you know, with your coffee in the morning vape. Now with the texture, I could all day vape. Okay. That. Yeah. And that's different between anybody, you know. Some all day vapes aren't for other people. And... Yeah, no, for sure. Um, just the, for me, I, I question the longe longevity, uh, longevity of the vape uh, just because of the sweetness. Um, I definitely think it's a really nice little treat though. And like mm. I said, I think with a cup of coffee, this would be fucking Dude, really, be really good. Living so. the dream. Yeah. Man, I, it's one of those fucking uh, juices you keep vaping so much your hattie gets fucking red hot. Yeah, you know man. I mean? and, we're, <laughs> and we're barely talking. Um, it is a perfect Danish with a butterscotch drizzle. Um, they, you can tell they've worked on it. They've, they've, you know, went this way and backed it off this way and went it, and they've really just fine tuned it. It's a fucking Danish. It's um, really, really well done, really well put together vape. Um, you, like Josh said, you can tell that they that this isn't their first uh, this isn't their first shot. You know what I mean? They probably have, yeah. have gone through several iterations tinkered. of this. Tinkered. Because it's just so perfectly well put together yep. that it's hard to it's hard to imagine this is their first. You don't uh, just come up with yeah. this. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go four point four. It's that great. Uh, I'm gonna say four. I think that it's it's definitely above average and it's worth checking out if you're like uh, into uh, pastry vapes if you're into like butterscotch those are really you know because yeah. those are the two main flavors of this vape um, I think it's really good I don't think that I would vape it all the time but I do think I would vape it occasionally like like, like I said like after dinner yeah, as yeah. a dessert or uh, with coffee I think it would be beautiful really texture really did yeah. they really did a great job with the texture on this so uh, check out the link go check out all their juices great stuff uh, you can't go wrong with these lines Wow. So far, I mean, uh, literally, so far, it's been, like, some of the better juices that we've had in these categories, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like a pastry and a frap, you know, like a strawberry milkshake kind of style. They're, they're really, them. really good representations of those flavors. Spot on. So, yeah. I'm really excited about the mocha. we got yeah. one more to go. It's called Mo Mocha. Look forward to that. We're going to do that next, so yep. you can look forward to that shit. Peep it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much. Yep. Oh, shit. He brought out the Cobra Strikes. Lucky. That's how you know you're lucky. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Tyra fam. You know, you're uh, definitely part of our fam. So yep. keep that shit uh, keep Love that shit it. up. All right. Keep your coils tight. Keep your wicks wet. Another Cobra. Lucky. Lucky. You're never going to make it out of here alive. <laughs>